Hey guys, this is Ganesh. Welcome back to Ganesh Jada Automation Studio. So today we are going to learn about the how to generate test ng folder in IntelliJ IDEA. So many students have the issue whenever they are running their Selenium test ng scripts in the IntelliJ IDEA, they don't able to see test output folder uh, in their project. So how exactly how exactly we can, we are creating those those product those those folder in in our project. So let's uh, I'm showing the I'm showing you the one of the example like so this is my example this is my project structure I have and this is the one of the script I have which is named as a verify generate folder. So I'm just as usual I'm defining the software set I'm as usual I'm setting the property of the Chrome driver I'm opening the instance I'm opening the URL and just simple one assertion I'm doing. So this is just for a demo that's it guys. Okay and I'm closing the driver once I run this program. Once I run this program, my script is running and you can see it is opening the browser and fetching the title of this URL and then I'm applying the assertion over there. Now, uh, it's, it's running here. You can see Chrome driver was started successfully. And uh, here your Chrome browser is open. It, it will close and my script will successfully pass. But here on this left hand left hand side of this structure, where is my test output folder? So in that test output folder, all files are present over there. So this is the target folder, which in this target folder, we don't have that HTML file, test uh, pass XML, XML file, then test fail XML file. We don't have, we don't have that, we don't have the file because of that all files contains in the test output folder how we are generating these terms in our in our uh, in the IntelliJ tool. So for that guys what exactly you need to do you just need to click on this uh, this this edit configuration option. Once you click on this edit configuration option you need to here you can see you you need to click on this listeners options. Once you click on the listeners option you can see use default reporter this option you must need to check. Okay once you check this options and here you need to select on the apply apply button and you you need to click on the ok button once this is done just try to again rerun this again just try to rerun this file guys okay i'm just rerunning this script uh, my verify generate folder scripts i'm rerunning and you can see after the passing after the successfully pass this script on your left hand side the test output folder will be generated now let's let's wait for a couple of seconds only guys now my Chrome driver was started successfully. Here you can see now Google.com website will open. I'm fetching the title of this website and I'm just applying the assertion. Now here you can see once this is done, once this is done, here you can see test output folder is automatically generated over here. And once I navigate this folder, you can see like default suit, JUnit, old, then then this index.html file. So all these things are at generated over here you can see the results you can see the results as well and uh, here you can see this this is the results also you can see so this is my past test case so you can see the results as well uh, then then skip test cases test ng test cases all kind of reports you can see over here and this the test ng result.xml file this is how we can find out the all like this this all files reside in the test output folder and this is how we are generating the test output folder in that IntelliJ idea hope this video is really helpful for you thanks for watching please don't forget to like and subscribe my youtube channel